Power Rangers, The Flash, Harry Potter. What do they all have in common? The Thunderbolt. But I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about this guy. Hey everyone, welcome to DIY in 5, the show where we make tech easy for the everyday user. I'm your host, Trisha Hirschberger, and today we are talking about brand spanking new technology, Thunderbolt 3.0. What is it? What does it do? Why should you care? And so on. If you find the info in today's video useful, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can find out about more awesome new tech and impress your friends when you chat about it later. So what is Thunderbolt tech and where did it come from? Thunderbolt was originally a hardware interface standard developed by Intel in collaboration with Apple. It was twice as fast as USB 3.0 at the time and could transfer both serial data to hard drives and peripherals and video data to displays. Now this tech was, and still is, so impressive because it combines PCI Express and DisplayPort into two serial signals, plus it provides power all in one cable. And did I mention it could also daisy chain together, i.e. I plug my hard drive into my computer and my monitor into my hard drive and it all works? The first two iterations used a mini display port connector and were revolutionary for their time. But now we've got Thunderbolt 3.0, which uses an even smaller USB-C connector and blows its predecessors out of the water. In comparison to Thunderbolt 2.0, it doubles the bandwidth to 40 gigabits per second, which is crazy fast, uses less power by half and can output two 4K displays at 60 Hertz, plus transfer up to 100 watts of power. I'm not kidding. It's widely called, and I quote, the USB-C that does it all. Plus, the fact that it uses the widely accepted USB connector opens it up to tech outside of Cupertino. Okay, so why would you need Thunderbolt 3? As 4K becomes more prevalent and SSDs get faster and larger and laptops get thinner and smaller, the ports we know and love just can't keep up. Want a two 4K display setup with only one cable to your computer? Thunderbolt 3. Want to frequently access data on more than one external hard drive and do it quickly and seamlessly? Thunderbolt 3. <coughs> Four times faster than USB 3.1. <clears throat> Want to beef up your laptop graphics with an external GPU? Thunderbolt 3! Want to connect to a friend's PC using one cable and get a 10 gigabyte ethernet connection between the two? Thunderbolt 3! And how about all of that plus at the same time charge your laptop? Done and done. Now I know, I know, simmer down Trish, but new tech like this enables things to go from futuristic concept to in consumer hands reality. eGPUs are a great example. Only a few years ago, eGPUs were a distant idea of what dreams may come, and now they're being mass produced. Laptops and Ultrabooks can be made thinner than ever without the need of bulky ports. Docking laptops with ease because of the speed and simplicity of a single cable. Up until now, VR headsets have needed multiple cables to deliver the resolution needed for a high-end experience. But Thunderbolt 3 can push the pixels fast enough so that soon this may not be the case. The benefits are endless. So where do you find this new tech? If you see a tiny lightning bolt logo, you can be sure that the port or cable in question supports Thunderbolt 3. Now these logos aren't required, so sometimes you may get a pleasant surprise, but usually this is a solid indicator. Where do you think Thunderbolt tech will take us next? What would you like to see? Let us know in the comments. It's really, really fun to dream. I'm Trisha Hirschberger, and I'll see you next time with more DIY in 5.